couple new today. A sober living house in Frederick County, Maryland is claiming discrimination after receiving multiple fines from the town of Thurmont. Frederick County reporter, uh, our Frederick County reporter spoke with the owner. Skylar Salas spoke uh, with the owner and has more details. Yeah, up and out sober living has multiple houses in Frederick County like this one dedicated to giving a home to those in recovery. But the owner tells me he was surprised when he saw a citation from the town of Thurmont stating the house is violating their zoning regulations. Corey Shorb started the up and out sober house back in 2017 after he had been dealing with his own sobriety for 16 years to give people a place to recover comfortably. But soon Shorb started getting concerns from a neighbor. She found out that this was a sober house. She kept calling it a recovery house. And there's difference. Like people use different terminology, boarding house, recovery house, sober house. They're all different. Later, Shore received several fines for zoning violations from the town of Thurmont. He claims even though the house is protected through the Federal Fair Housing Act, the fines are discriminating against them due to them being a sober living house. It's just, it's frustrating because people, it's, you know, contempt prior to investigation. You know, people have no clue what goes on in here. Um, these guys, I mean, anybody that knows me and knows up and out sober living, I, I run a tight ship. If they're not about their recovery, they're not going to live here. Um, we teach them discipline, structure, um, and that's, they're big. You know, we need structure and discipline and guidance um, in order to be successful. We reached out to Leslie Powell, who's the attorney for the town of Thurmont, about the issue. She released a statement saying, in part, this zoning violation relates solely to the operation of the house by a business owner as a boarding facility in a single family R2 zone. The R2 zone does not permit a boarding house use. Shorbs hopes that with time, both the town and the neighborhood will see the work they do as something good for the community. I just hope it, it all works out. You know, it'll work out the way it's supposed to work out. Reporting in Thurmont, Maryland, Skylar Salas for DC News Now.